Hi everyone, it's Deborah. Today, uh, we're gonna talk about a lot of subjects and this is a top from White House Black Market. It's got a, a sexy back. You see, it's got a sexy back. Um, I'm not sure where I got this necklace from, maybe Cato. Okay, um, so I'm gonna talk also about one of my boyfriends. Uh, I only had three serious relationships in my life. Um, I don't know how many of you all have been married for four decades, but I was to one man. And then I've had uh, three relationships after that marriage. And this was one of the gentlemen. Uh, he was not ready to commit. He was not ready to get me um, uh, an engagement ring. He was not ready to give me a date for the wedding, but yet he expected all the relationship benefits that a marriage entails, if you know what I'm trying to say. So yeah, my, my video I did on my shoes and my feet and my hats got flagged by YouTube. Oh my God. Yeah, I got a strike. <laughs> My God, uh, yeah, so you guys out there that are not willing to commit to a lady, but yet you expect her to give out, don't do that. It's confusing to the ladies, stop it. It is also abuse, whether you know it or not, it is abuse to keep hanging on to all those wonderful benefits. You get, you know, your laundry done or you get to have sex, you know, every night, but yet you can't commit to this girl. That happened to me, and it was very heartbreaking. Um, and I did cut it off because you can. Women are only going to hang on for so long, people. Um, also. Uh, my family is so large that uh, I used to go to a lot of funerals. I don't anymore. But this bothers me a lot. It's when uh, you go to a funeral and everybody's crying, you know, over your casket, over the casket or whoever might have passed. And because I'm the oldest of five generations, I'm the matriarch. I want to get a hold of them and shake them and say, wait a minute, you only visited them once in 60 years? You two-faced hypocrite. One of my good friends said it like it needs to be said, and that is, visit your loved ones now. So this is how you can put it in perspective. If you only visit your mom or dad or your sister once a year and she may live, or they may live maybe just five years. You're only gonna see them five more times. Do you see? That's not enough people. You should take time vacations to go visit your loved ones while they're here. Uh, a lot of young people are no longer on this earth because of overdoses. You know, you never know when you're gonna lose a loved one. Uh, especially with car accidents and motorcycle accidents. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching. And listen, I'm only a few people away from 50,000 subscribers. So hit that subscribe button for me. Tell your friends, especially your older, the older gentlemen's friends and, your, and the older ladies. I need more ladies on my channel. For some reason, they just don't gravitate to me. I, I don't know why. I, all right. Bye.